everybody, Gamer Penny here, bringing you another episode of our Wilder Myth Let's Play, and we are back. Um, no, I want to take Mug. Uh, we should take Denkin though. Or let's have Estee sit out. Take Mud. All right, let's go. We're gonna go battle this guy. Let's go. Okay. Uh oh. Yeah, we're on our way. We're on our way down. That's why we put the three... Three defense there. Attack! This is it! Stormkin Mine! The Morthogi are around here somewhere. Keep your eyes peeled. We'll fight soon enough, but first... Knock knock. What? Who are you? What are you doing here? <laughs> we're the Horse Bannermen. But never mind that. This is Stormkin Mine, isn't it? Home of the best brews this side of Genoma, Sperry? Your spirits have been called the Nectar of the Gods. Yeah, this is Stormkin Mine, and you heard right about my spirits, but I ain't brewed nothing these past few weeks. But why? Thrice cursed Morthoggy scum is why. Come on, see for yourself. Oh, that's putrid. Foul use of my fine establishment. They got me brewing up this vile concoction for them. I bring them fresh batches every few days in the ruins, pour it right into their veins. If they have veins, that is. It does something wicked to them, this brew. Makes them faster and stronger. Uh, why are you helping them? They- they have my wife. Ah. They pour this liquid right into their veins, she says. That's right, you should see how they glow afterwards. Hmm. How do you feel about making a special batch? What are you planning, Drimvire? That we mess with the formula. Are you sure about this? Yes. We're right here. Okay, hello! I'm here with today's batch. Uh-oh, I hope it works. Wow, that's... Ew. It's kind of how hummingbirds feed. It's totally gross. At first, it seems nothing happens, and then... It's working! <laughs> okay, good. Suffer two damage to start the mission. Perfect! All right, welcome to the group, Duncan. I'm gonna have you go here and um, take a shot on that guy. Oh, who are we, Mud? Mud, come up here. Get that guy out. Oh, come on. Okay. You interfuse with the rope. Constrict. You come here. Strike. Oh, come on. Uh oh. That's fine. I can take another shot. Good job, mud. And you're gonna come here. And you're gonna come here. Open the door. Uh-huh. You're gonna come right here. Jump jolt. You are gonna silk step here. Okay. 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 <laughs> Come here, wall with them. That's all you can do. Mud. Very nice. And you do uh, get to come up here, I think, because even at the end of your move, you're guarding. Yes. Alright, interfuse with this. Um, scalding rain. Okay. Here. Swap your weapon and take a shot at that guy. Okay, never mind. Good job. Good job. Okay. Okay. 
Yay! Okay. I really is gonna level up. Mud might. Nah. Now a hunter. Um. Ooh, here, cause she's. You never really fun to action point up to three times per turn. Wow. Uh, let's do this one. Dodge necklace. Put that on you. That's the last of them. You can come out now, Milmere. That was incredible. You were amazing. But Gally, where is she? Look, over there. Milamir? Is that you? Gally, you came! Of course I did. I couldn't have done it without these folks. I can never repay you, but you'll never want for something fine to drink. Yay! Alright, got that one done. Let's secure it. Find an item. Go, 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 go. Oh. Didn't we stop that incursion? I think it might get stopped on there. Because that's a three defense. Oh. Oh my god. <laughs> he looks so freaking amazing. <laughs> yes. I'm gonna see if that one gets that incursion. Tile defenses withstood an attack. Uh oh. Did another attack. Alright, let's go gather here then. Defend it. Let's go. Okay. Um. I'm gonna try this one. Did we win? Attempt. Oh, nope. We did not. <laughs> okay. Oh my god, is Denkin up there by himself? Alright, well he is coming down here. Oh, and Narmir. I'll open that door and do a little wait. Man, one looks so amazing. Alright. I'm just gonna come here. Guardian. Here, come here. Oh. Uh, here, wall. Wait. You come down here. She automatically goes into guardian stance. You're gonna wall with her. Jump jolt. Perfect. You get to wall with mud. That. And then silk step over here. You come moi. Okay. Uh oh. Fine. Good. Oof. Dreamfire, uh, you're getting out of there, bud. Because you are up there alone. Um, down here. Out of there. Um. Oh, come on. Skunk spray. It's gonna hit her, though, too. Well, that doesn't. Okay. Perfect. Swap your weapon. Come over here. Oh, good. Eh. 
Man, she's uh she's pretty good at this. We're just leading him down here basically, and that's okay. Door. Here. Thinking. I have him come up this way, because she can take care of that. Good. And, um, they're gonna start coming from that way, so let's interfuse here. And give it a little wait. We get to move here. Straight. And then move up next to mud. Alright, here they come. Here, Duncan. You don't have really anything to help you do better damage. Mud's gonna come up front. There you go. You're down here. Oops. Oh, and you here. Nope, nothing yet, so... Let's wait. Okay. Can you get a kill, Duncan? No. <laughs> Mud will. Perfect. Then we are all just going to wait for the other thing to come down here. There he is. Oh. I really you can't do anything. I got that. You take a shot. Oh! An army or killed him. <laughs> All right, Mud, you coming? Leveling up? Yes, good. Mud and Denkin are now rivals. Uh oh, <laughs> what happened? Okay, after hitting with a non-swift melee attack, if Mud still has action left, he can move up to half his speed. Um, Mud's allies gain plus two speed for this turn. Ooh, let's do Wolf Call. Yeah. Okay, we stopped the incursion. Let's build another defense on this, actually. Done. Go. Um, I have five legacy points. None of these. Oh, we are fighting deepest. I'm gonna cancel that one. Okay, and then let's go. Finish building this. Okay, let's go here. Um, I'd like Duncan to level up, so. Okay. The Thrixel shouldn't be too much further ahead of us. I could have sworn they went this way. They did. Look, behind those rocks. What have you found, Duncan? Tunnels, buried deep into the earth. Should we check them out? Uh, we can lay trap and wait for them to emerge. Yeah. Hurry, who knows when they'll get back. This is a cowardly way to engage our foes. Sometimes the best route is the safest. It's not cowardly to use every advantage. I, you're right. 
Let's get started. Oh. Working together, they fashion a trap from nearby saplings. Now we cover it with fallen leaves. I hear something. Everyone hide. They quickly hide behind the rocks. The sounds of chittering grow ever, ever louder. The insectoid creatures emerge from the earth, spindly legs carrying them into the sunlight. And then... It worked. Yes, but it won't hold them for long. We have the advantage. Attack! I really like Mud and Chaser being friends. <laughs> Alright. Uh, get up here and open the door, Duncan. Whoa! And then just move back one. <laughs> just like that. Um, who can get up? You can. Okay. Perfect. Then she guardians. And then you can get up here. Do a jump jolt. Perfect. Whoa, we even hit that guy back there. Silk step please here. Mud. Just get here. Um, can mud make it up there? No. Can Dreamfire? Yes. Uh oh. Whoa. Nice. Why don't you come here? Nice. Bar, bar, bow. I really come here. Wait, Duncan. These has a shot here. Okay, better than nothing. You just go right here. Guardian. Uh oh. Um. Guardian. Duncan, go here. Take that shot. Good. Uh, mud. Get up here. Interfuse that. Steal fire onto this guy. Oh, good. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> that was very nice. You. I just want you to get up as quickly as you can. Okay. They don't see her, I don't think. Uh oh. Oh, you came to your death. Way to go, Duncan! Alright. Nicely done. Bow, bow, bow. Tier one. Salvage it. Okay. Got that done. Let us find an item. Hopefully one that we can use, please. Bum, bum. we get warding eight I really she would have really great warding um yeah let's give it to I really okay Alright, and we're gonna build just a uh, tier 2 defense here. Oh, one more. Okay. Now comes the big scout. Should we bring Esta instead of Denkin? I think so, probably. So I think this is the uh, final one. Get over here! And Duncan, good luck. You by yourself. They're like 
Soldiers. I was told there was a cave down in that valley. Looks like they're on the move. People I grew up with. We may be forced to fight them. If you're not up to that, then stay clear. But don't be mean to Ivory. When others make bad choices, you've got to choose against them, whether or not it hurts. Aww. Okay. Find the leader. Oh boy. Alright, mud. Front and center. My boy. All done. Grimfire. Not to be outdone. You can jump, Joel. Okay, never mind. Iverly. Here. That guy. Oh, not quite. Not quite either. Oh, look what you've done. Okay, good. Um, Chaser, can you please take him out this time? Thank you. Mud. Front and center again, my boy. The priestess stands tall and stares, her silver eyes aglow. Her army, her small army clangs their weapons and moans and mutters. It's horrible. She's important. She's far down her path. You come and interfere with the will of the prophet, son lovers. You murder his disciples. You debauch the soil. You turn your faces from what is stone. The priest's voice is smooth, sonorous, deep. It vibrates in the bones of all who listen. Here and now, I forbid you from ever descending. You'll never know the warmth that lies below. She tosses a small flask upon the embers of her fire. It shatters among the coals. A flood of shadows jets up, uh, drowning the sun. Ac acolytes, those who have been awakened to the deep truths, extinguish these star-led murderers. We take her down. It's over. In we go. Okay. Okay. There she is. Alright. Mud. Uh, up front, bud. Oh no! I didn't want to do that for her. Dang it. Okay. Get hidden. Come up. Come up next to mud, please. Pick that up. Good. Oh. Uh-oh. Okay, phew. Got your back, he says. Okay. Strike this guy. Actually, I'm gonna have you come up here. Okay, that's also okay. Get the big guy. You. Come here. This guy. Good. And she's guarding. Uh, you come here. Interfuse with... This is mushrooms? Okay. Wild grass. Uh... Okay. Okay. You just get in the room. I don't think they can see you. Uh, who can we take out? This guy. It's okay. It's also okay. I keep pushing him back, man. Good. It's also okay. His poor armor. Earth fuse. Uh oh. Ow! What the heck? Alright, mud. Can't move. Grimfire. It's okay. 
Very nice. Good. Aha! We did it! Okay. <laughs> cool. I thought we'd have to kill off the rest, but that's okay. Another throwing net. <coughs> I'm actually going to salvage that one. The speaker falls and her army stills. They make no cries. Then their voices low and groan like cattle and they scatter. Their thumping feet fade into the hills. Chaser douses a fire, but the shroud lingers overhead. She's dead. Was hoping we'd be able to get answers from her. Carnage and smoke reek around them. How many today? How many of them were my own, my neighbors, my... They began to believe, as I did, that they could live free of misery, and so they chained themselves to misery's master. Then we have to find the root of the problem, don't we? Sever it, or who will? Aww. It'll destroy her if she's not careful. It'll drive her a good long time. Oh, 11 years of peace follow. Okay. Oh good, yes. Take some of the- Oh good. Take that one out. Okay. During the years of peace, the pilgrim, Kimyun, saw his sister's statue moved to a peaceful, fragrant, fragrant place. There, for the rest of his days, he stayed, reading to the stone woman and talking to her about all he'd seen and done, wandering with the grace of Dale. He would be buried beside her. Aww. Mud perfected the time-honored art of not doing a damn thing. I love him so much. <laughs> Peace survived for a precious while, guarded by those who walked the hills and roads. But towns continued to tense and shrink. Homes lost their families, and all manner of things were found abandoned. Where were the people going? There was an answer no one voiced. For all, in, for all, in those years, it was like waiting below decks on a voyage to anywhere. Who can weigh the ballast of so many troubled hearts? They rode the sea of uncertain times as best they could. Denkin was invited to join the hunters at Dome Leap Blind for a trip one season. They came home with little meat for the hearth, but many tales to tell around it. Este noticed that the library at Bellunland had fallen into disrepair during all the conflict, so she passed a summer helping to rebuild it. Chaser was visited once by a woman cloaked in ivy. Spirit lay out three futures for Chaser to pick from. After careful deliberation, one was finally picked. What did he pick? Oh, oh he's got a bare leg! Minus speed, but plus health? Oh my god, do we want mud to be transforming into a bear? Yeah. All right, um, and mud, I really would like to upgrade this if we could. Craft that. Okay. Um, who else? Ivory, your dagger, maybe? Craft that. Um. Grimfire, maybe... Man, they're all getting old, ain't they? Shield. Um... Pick up your bow. That one. Okay. I really, I would like you to actually have this too. Armor and dodge, yeah. Alright, that should be good for now. The night went normally for Chaser, who snuffed his candle at nine. Found his bed and tricked himself to sleep. <laughs> Chaser! Chaser, wake up, you in there? The morning wasn't quite as routine. Was that a monster out there? All right, I'm a, I'm awake. Getting too old for this. They came from all over. Denkin's making a stand by the well. Uh-oh. Is this kind the kind of end I meet? 
Roasted and buried under burning timbers? No, I think not. Yeah, he knows his fate. The shadows deepen. All monster groups will draw an extra monster card. Uh-oh. Okay. Kind of bored. Oh, we're right into it. Um... Okay, Mud and Chase are over here. Let's start with them. Okay. You guys are down here. Over here. Oh. Oh, <laughs> okay, hit one of them. Uh, oh, Este is going to be in a world of hurt over there. All right, we're going to go through here. Done. I really... Let's come here and take him out. Thank you. Silk so step over here. <clears throat> um, hmm. Why don't you come over here? We'll also shoot this guy. Okay. Duncan, I'm gonna need you to help her, I think. We should have probably given him a better bow. <laughs> Uh-oh. Watch out, Duncan! Oh, perfect. Wow, good job, Drimbar. <laughs> Uh-oh, another speaker. Oh, watch out! Okay. Um, Chaser, let's move you on here. Locked. Okay, nothing's down there. I can get you up here. Uh-oh. There is something down there. You. Um... Actually, come here. Okay. All right. Well, at least get that guy done. Mud. I just need you up here. Why? Why would you go through the fire like that? Okay. Oh, come on. Alright. Uh. Nice. I release. Uh, now you can come down here. Shoot this guy. Thinking. Good. Mud. Uh, I'm gonna have you start making your way down here. How dare you? Good. Okay. Bunch of little guys. All right, um, let's come here. I thought you were mud, but that does the trick. <laughs> um, come here. Silk step, right there. Shoot the little one. Ah. 
Oops, you come here and wall. Come here. Guardian. Alright, where are these other foes? You? Where are you going? Where are you going, you little turd? Right over here. You can't see him from there, but... Oh, maybe you can. He's just hidden right now. There we go. Good. Um, I'm gonna ambush down here. Okay. Silk step next to mud. Guardian, guardian, done, done. Where are they? Are they over here? Dreamfire, if you could come down here, see if you can see anyone coming. Nope. Uh, I just don't know. Nope. Nope. What the heck, man? I have no idea where they're at. Oh, in here, maybe. Huh? Mud? Get ready to open that door. There's one. Um, Drimvire, how about... Come up here. Okay. Here. 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 Wait. Oh, God. Mud. Oh, Dreamfire, come on. You're better than that. Uh, take a shot here. Good. Dinkin. Get up here next to mud. Chaser. We're gonna need help, Dreamfire, because if I think she might get hurt pretty bad. I can't do that without hurting her. Oh, there we go. Uh, get up here. Okay, good. Perfect. Is that it? Whew. Give her that to her. Yeah. Ooh. Shield. Dreamfire will retire at the end of this chapter. All right, salvage it. <laughs> Okay, um, hmm. Negative status. Uh, yeah, let's get aid. She's retiring. Um, let's do this. At least we made them pay for it. Not sure they value their own lives, even. Ah, oh, well, come on, let's put these fires out. Sure. Morning is bitter and hot, the sky not yet light, stars all swarmed with smoke. Bodies are found burned, buildings gone to cinders. Others survive. They'll live alongside charred memories. Dawn will discover a changed world. Aww. 
okay? Alright, what does everything look like? Oh, a local shrine serves as a meeting place for hill folk, farmers, people of all kinds. It's away from the smoke. They convene there around twilight. The suffering's vast. Bigger than this one town. Bigger than us or our people. All through the day, travelers have come from other provinces. Dark news on their tongues. All dismayed to see smoke over Jinnamosbury. Terror and ruin have erupted everywhere. Bridges destroyed, passes collapsed, innocents being harried, made homeless or worse. Could be we've had the wrong approach from the start. What do you mean? Think about all we've done to this point. The fight, the task, the journeys. It's all been reactive, hasn't it? Trying to fix what they've already broke. See your point, but if we're meant to hit them, we need a target first, don't we? Most we've ever found are small dens. Maybe it's not about hitting them at all. Not directly. Maybe it's about loosening their grip on impressionable minds. I see. We have to look at what their goal seems to be. Swelling their own ranks. And we get in front of it. We foster hope, health, security. We build, we sow, we, reinf we reinforce. Right. They prey upon weakened communities. So we make the community strong. That way... That way they either wane to nothing like a flame on a burnt black bow or they have to fight us. They have to come out and face us head on. Their conversations continue long into the night, but by the time the stars fade, a plan is freshly born. Okay, so we're all here. Let's rebuild. Let's go. Repair this, no, I'm not sending one person by themselves. Repair, repair. That one got taken over. Do we have no new ones? Build two bridges, passes, repair all towns, secure all sites. Really? Opportunity. Grimvire. Blue topple. I thought those only grew in brisk fields. They'd get choked out here. A field is a symphony with melodies that rise and fall for those who listen. The rabbits have grown bold. For rabbits, anyway. And a trained ear may notice when they go slightly off key. That's the fourth quail I've seen this week. Four is an ill-fated number. Try to spot another one soon. But he's not from around here. Who among us is, really? We're all just travelers in this vast... Ron Tailfeather, see? Ones from here have the reddish tails. This one just goes gray. Don't harass the little traveler. Gray tails are from brisk fields. Flowers, rabbits, and quail. All coming in from... Something's wrong in brisk fields. You're getting that from some animals? The information is all there. You simply have to pay attention. I pay attention. I pay attention to who's having a bad day so I can keep them off your back. I pay attention to the direction of the wind and which leaves will crunch underfoot. I'll pay attention to those things. You pay attention to the quails and together we'll be unstoppable. How's that sound? Sounds perfect. Whatever's going on in Bristfields, it'll be good to have another pair of eyes and ears and another nose. Sure, why not? <laughs> Alright, I'll get my things. Alright. Uh. Yeah, we'll send Chaser with you. Go! Mm -mm 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 -mm. Genomus bird is completed. Sun will shine dimmer in their lives. Get, um. Defense going here. Tier 2. Okay, Dreamfire and Ivory have arrived. So I finally catch up to them, and you know where all four raccoons ended up? Perched right in the crook of a grandmother tree. The branches really do swirl like that, turns out. So then what? I brought them another pie. Can't be too careful when it comes to grandmother tree's goodwill. Well, you made it this far. Must have been a good pie. When they ask around Briskfields, people don't hesitate to point them to Havel's farmstead. It's because all the weird stuff happens to me. Not all of it. <laughs> yeah, look at him, man. Listen, my family's been here a long time. We tamed this land, you understand? Got some cornbread here. It's not fancy. And now those deathless have moved in. Mortimers. What you call them? The skull guys. At first, I'd only hear them at night. Then, for a while, they'd scatter into the trees when they saw me. But now they're getting bolder. They're butting up against the north fields. 
I thought they were there for the corn, but now I'm not sure what they think they're doing. You should go see for yourself. A hedge on the north edge of the field is just high enough to peer over. The spindly figures of Morthagi march back and forth. Claws scrape at the dirt and handle saplings with surprising delicacy. They're planting trees. Sinister trees? Completely normal trees. In time, a forest will grow here. So we're what? Leaving them? We're strategically disengaging. I trust you have your reasons. It's just someone's gonna have to tell Havel. <laughs> You're what? They're not aggressive. We've decided to let them continue. We don't start unnecessary fights. I thought that's what the, you were all about, making the land safe. What about my land? Your fields don't seem to be threatened. If anything, they've driven off the vermin. You're scared. Uh-oh. Dreamfire's fought far worse than the little diggers in your backyard. <laughs> oh, dang, dude. She's just got a keen eye and enough smarts to not make the world any worse than it is. Thank you very much for your hospitality, but we'll be going now. <laughs> Next day. Maybe we should have waited till morning to stomp out. Eh, one more night sleeping under the stars didn't kill us. Would have been nice to have some cornbread for the road, though. What, sticking to your principles doesn't have the same delicious buttery taste? My principles. You don't spare Morthagi's life just to get yelled at without some kind of principles. I mean, I'll crunch up a Morthagi when it's called for. But it's always a choice. You look at each situation and you make the choice. I never want to get to the point where I'm not making that choice anymore. Paying attention. Exactly. Glad someone is. Aww. Minus a leggy point, legacy point, but three heart wounds. Oh, and plus ten retirement. Oh, maybe she won't retire this age. Um. No, no. Uh, I don't like any of these. Do this one. All right. Go get that one repaired while they're building defenses. Okay, and we'll add you guys there, and Mud's gonna just chill for a bit. Oh, Denkin and Este have fallen in love? What the heck? Place is getting too familiar. Alright, then we gotta go assault that. Okay, cool! Well, I think what we'll do now is we'll go ahead and end this episode here, and when we come back, uh, we'll try to go... To build two bridges passes repair all towns secure all sites we'll try to go repair um secure some stuff and then i don't know i guess they destroyed our bridges and passes so we'll have to rebuild those <laughs> so guys i want to thank you so much for all of your support on this series if you do want to see more of the wilder myth let's play make sure to leave a like or subscribe to the channel otherwise i will see you guys next time all right bye everyone